guys, welcome back and a very Merry Christmas to everyone. I thought I... <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back and very Merry Christmas to everyone. I hope you all had a wonderful day yesterday and you spent it with all your loved ones and you just spent your day making memories and just... What is this? It's my hair, that's what my hair looks like. Um, anyway, I hope you all had a really wonderful, wonderful special day yesterday and you made loads of lovely memories with your family. Um, I am going to this year, because I didn't do it last year, I am going to do it the What I Got For Christmas video. Um, I am, of course, not bragging. Um, I am so beyond grateful for everything that I got. I have been spoiled rotten this year and uh, I know that a lot of people do like to watch these videos. Um, I love watching these videos. I get really excited uh, seeing what everyone got for Christmas because I like to see everyone happy. So I thought I would do one this year. Um, I am doing it on Boxing Day, not on Christmas Day, as I had originally planned um, because it was just so hectic yesterday. Uh, usually um, it's just me, my mum and my stepdad for for Christmas. Okay. Usually it's just me, my mum and my stepdad for Christmas. Um, but this year my mum decided, uh, no, we're not doing that. Uh, we're not visiting other people's houses. We're all going to have a Christmas dinner together, all under the one roof. So uh, there was 13 people, I think, yesterday, 12, 13. Uh, at my mum's house for Christmas yesterday, so uh, I had absolutely no time to film a video for you um, because obviously I had to help my mum with uh, with all the, the Christmas prep and everything like that, so um, that's why I'm filming it today. However, I did hit the Boxing Day sales today, so I'm going to do that video tomorrow and hopefully post it for you tomorrow as well. So there is another video to look forward to. This is just my, this is my Christmas, this is not Boxing Day sales. And, oh, I don't even know where to begin, do you know that? I literally just kind of piled everything up here and I'm looking at it like, okay, <laughs> two and a half minutes and I'm still rambling and, oh, I'm exhausted. I mean, it was such a, a like I said, a wonderful special day and I just laughed so, so much, but I am exhausted. I mean, I mean, let's just take a second to look at these bags under my eyes. I mean, you, you could go on holiday with that. That is luggage. I am so exhausted, but I really wanted to film this for you and I didn't want to leave it too late to do it. And also, I was really careful not to use any of my Christmas presents, apart from this jumper, um, until I had showed you them. And frankly, I really want to get in about some of this. So, um, so yeah, um, yeah, three minutes in and I'm still going on. So let's get on with the video. Uh, okay, so first thing I'll show you, um, this, uh, this is a present from my mum and my stepdad and look at this little box, it's so cute, I, I actually don't even want to throw the box away because it's so cute, uh, but what it is, is it's little espresso cups, I mean look how cute they are, they're just so nice I absolutely love these, I have no means of making espresso because my coffee my coffee machine is just a standard coffee machine but I will find a way, I don't care how I'm going to do it but I'm going to make espresso and I'm going to have espresso I'll buy an espresso machine if I have to because I love these cups so so much they're so cute so thank you so much for that I can't get them back in the box so we're just going to just going to stick them down there okay and next thing, uh, also from my mum and my stepdad, is this. It is a tea light holder, as you probably can tell. And it's like that, and it's at the top here. You can put in um, essential oils or wax melts. And my mum got me this uh, because if you remember in a previous video that I uploaded a couple of weeks ago, I was just going on and on and on, uh, much like I do in every video about how, um, how much I wanted to like have my bathroom smelling a bit nicer, but obviously you can't plug a wax melt into your bathroom. So my mum got me this here so that I can melt my nice bathroom smells in that. So it will be going in there. Thank you very much, mum. Okay, and along the same lines, how beautiful is this? I mean, this is just gorgeous. Uh, this comes off and again you put oils or wax in here and a wee tea light in here 
and just let your house smell all beautiful. But let's just, oh, look at these angels. I think that's meant to be a rabbit I, in her arms. I don't know, but it's cute anyway. This one has a wee bird. This one has some flowers. I mean, just it's just so lovely. I'm, I'm, I love this so much. I've not settled on a place for it yet, but I will find one because it's so cute and I love it so much. So, I have not thought this video out at all in my sleep deprived state because there's so much to show you and nowhere to put it after I've showed you. So there'll be a lot of like this going on, I think. Roll with it. Okay, and I got this. It is a wee chocolate. It's meant to be a reindeer. It says it on the bottom, so I know it's meant to be a reindeer, but that is, that's not a reindeer. Who? What? But it's chocolate anyway, so I am not complaining. I love some chocolate. I will be munching this later while I'm watching the TV. My wee chocolate reindeer. So, got that. Okay, and next thing to show you... Anyway, uh, I have three of these. <laughs> They're all the same. They're all pumpkin spice. Uh, so I'll just show you one. Um, if you remember in my last video, um, I mentioned about 500,000 times um, that the pumpkin spice mainstay is my favourite, favourite smell in the entire world. So Diane um, got me one of these and my mum got me two. So I am all stocked up for the pumpkin spice and it's their candle and it's a three wick candle like that. Uh, so got that and also my mum kind of half burned one but she didn't like it very much so I have another half one floating about somewhere. So got these, thank you very much. My house will be smelling beautiful. <clears throat> Seven minutes in, I'm not even, I'm barely started, so we're just going to have to rattle through this. Okay, and Christmas staple, chocolate coins. Cannot go wrong with some chocolate coins, so I have three bags of those. Thank you very much. And would it really be any haul of mine if books weren't involved? Um, I did specifically ask for these. I don't specifically ask for very much. I'll, I'll drop some pretty heavy-handed hints at you, but I will rarely outright ask for anything. I did ask for these books, and I did also get another book that I think I might have left at my mum's. If it's not in this haul somewhere, I will add it to the book haul. Uh, as you know, there's another book haul coming up. Uh, so I'll add it to that and show you in that if it's not in here. So the first book I got is Stephen King's It. Now, I have seen both the movies. I've seen, obviously, the recent one and the original. The original was best. Like, let's let's be honest. Let's call a spade a spade. The original was far better. It was far superior to the thing that was brought out just there. I mean, that, that was good, but original all the way. And I'm certain I have read it before. I, I recall reading it. What I don't remember is it being this thick. What the actual? I mean, did did I block half of this book out or something? It was not this thick before. I'm not making that up. I mean, come on. But either way, got it and excited to reread it and read whatever else they've stuck in there because it was not this big before. So thank you very much. And also, uh, again, specifically asked for this. This is a book of fairy tales and folk tales by the Brothers Grimm. Um, most people will probably know that um, cartoons, like lots of Disney cartoons, um, are based on um, books by like the Brothers Grimm and, and people like that. And they're all, the original is obviously far more gory and just disturbing than what they can probably legally make it in a Disney film. So um, I'm so excited to read these. Obviously not all of these were turned into Disney films and equally not all Disney films were Brothers Grimm. However, <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm so warped, but I'm so, I'm just, thank you. I'm so excited. Need to power through. I'm, oh. Okay, and socks. 
is it truly Christmas unless you get some new socks? So, got these ones. These are cuddle socks and there's two pairs. Nice wee navy pair and a coloured pair. And yeah, pre-mark. Always pre-mark. Cannot be. You just can't go wrong with pre-mark socks. So, thank you very much for that. Okay, and oh, what's in the bag? Uh, oh, that's not meant to be in here. That's, that's a boxing day sale. Uh, okay, and... Um, so is that. Okay, and uh, oh, this was a wee present from my friend Taylor. Uh, if you're a subscriber of mine, you'll probably have heard me talking about her a couple of times. Uh, this is um, eyeliner stencils. Um, P.S. That's Primark, isn't it? Anyway, so these are eyeliner stencils because my eyeliner, when I when I do apply it, it's either fleeked or it's horrendous. There is never an in-between. I am either horrendous or I am on frickin' fleek. There is no in-between. So I think Taylor was tired of me having meltdowns and just got me this as a wee part of my Christmas. So thank you very much, babe. Thank you for that. And she also got me beer pong. So I'm excited to have this. I don't know if I've ever actually played beer pong. I think I have. I don't know, however, I'm always down for a good drinking game, so this will be happening at some point, so thank you very much, my darling. <clears throat> and in here, oh, I'm excited for this. I don't know if anyone else will be, but I am wet my pants excited for this. Um, I actually wasn't even hinting. I texted my mum a wee while ago. I work right near the Tenants Brewery, and I was in there kind of as part of something I was doing for my work, and I text my mum like, I think I want to tour the tenant's factory and uh, she blooming well went and got me a tour. So me and a friend of mine, um, my friend Fraser has already claimed dibs. So we will be going on a wee tour of the tenant's brewery at some point. So excited for that. Thank you very much, mum. Put it in there after. Okay, and oh, another candle. Can't beat a candle. Uh, this one, I believe, my, I've got to take the price off it. Who cares? Got a nice, lovely new candle. And this one, I believe, is from my Auntie Catherine. And it's pomegranate. Oh, that smell is... Oh, it's so nice. It's, it's fruity, it's pomegranate, so it's going to be in... Oh, yeah. Just, oh, thank you so much, Auntie Catherine. I don't know what room I'm burning it in, but it's getting burnt. Thank you so much. And she also got me a lovely pair of PJs. Can never ever go wrong gifting somebody a set of pyjamas. And it's just, it's a plain blue top and some lovely blue paisley bottoms. So, and again, she's forgot to take the price off, kind of sake. Uh, but who cares? I don't care how much my things cost. They could cost a penny, they could cost a million pound. I love them just the same. So I'm so ex I'm so happy to have these. Can never ever have enough pajamas in my opinion. When I'm home, if I'm not going out or if I have not been out, I am in pajamas. I can be home from my work four or five o'clock in the afternoon. Boom, jammies on. Before I do anything, the jammies are happening. I'm in walking in the house undoing my belt. That's happening. Okay, oh, also this jumper, I uh, got this for Christmas. I knew I was getting this because I was with my mum when she bought it and my mum has the matching pink one, so we're like twins. Um, it comes from Primark, just in case you like it. Uh, what is happening with my hair? Like, actually, like, what? what is that? That is like rat's tails. Anyway, it comes from Primark. Uh, it comes... It's from Primark. It's really soft and it's so cosy and it's so warm. And I just, if you're in Primark and you see it, please buy it. I can't, I can't stress it how enough. Just, it's lovely. So, get this. They have it in pink. Uh, I don't know if they have any other colours, but blue and pink. So, there we go. Okay. And oh, this one came from my cousin Cheryl, and it's so lovely. Um, it's like mini glass jars of sweets. And they've put like this over it as if it's like one of the, the brown paper wrapping. It does have a lid under there as well, but that ruins the illusion, so we'll, we'll talk about that. 
I mean, how cute is that? I mean, they're just these wee mini jars and they're full of all different kind of sweeties. So you've got jelly beans and dolly mixtures and I think they're uh, marshmallows. And these are my favourite milk bottles. So, and when I, and it's in this, it's actually like a wee metal case and it's it's just so lovely. Um, I'm probably going to use this maybe to put some spices in after, uh, after I've eaten all the sweets tonight. Uh, so yeah so thank you very much babe I love this so much so got that and I'm very very uncomfortable right now oh this video is a riot I'm just going to roll with it I am not re-recording I'm not having a whole new conversation with myself because I made an idiot a couple of times just going to roll with it Okay, and next thing I got was this from my mum and my stepdad and it's a wee hip flask and it says one vodka, two vodka, three vodka, floor. Uh, I think that is just so cute, I love that so much. Um, particularly because, let me tell you, I am a cheapskate and I hate going to functions like weddings and stuff like that and places always bump up the prices when you've got a function going on like if I go into the golf club on a not that I'm a member of a golf club but if I did if I went into the golf club on a regular Friday or Saturday it's like 3 50 a drink if I go in for a wedding they bumped it up to a fiver no my hip flask is happening I'm gonna put some vodka in there I'll pay for my coke how's that so <laughs> so ranty What's wrong with me? It's it's the spot. So got that. Thank you very much, mother. Okay, and yeah, another Christmas staple, the pants. Uh, so I'm actually really excited about these pants. I mean, I'm always excited about pants. Pants are amazing. Um, but got these, and they are. I think they're designed to kind of look a wee bit like men's briefs. So they've got this really awesome, like stretchy elastic bit at the waist. So and it says love. So I got these and I'm very happy about that. Thank you, Mum. And oh, let's just take a second to talk about the purse. I mean, how gorgeous is this? This came from Diane. Uh, it's just, it's so lovely. It's a lovely, like, big size and it's tartan. And look at the wee handcuffs. I mean, this is just amazing. I mean, wow. Oh, look, was that a skull? I thought it was just a circle. Oh, look at that. <laughs> it's got my beady red eyes. I love this. This is so lovely, and it's such. Just, and I mean, it's it's so me. It's it's perfect for me. Thank you so much, Diane. I'm so happy. Okay, and also from Diane, I got this, and uh, I've actually got no idea where it's from. I'm sorry. Um, there's no kind of label telling me what shop it's from. So if you like it, I'm afraid I can't tell you where to get it. But it's this, it's um, like an oversized but cropped, so it's baggy but short, um, Batman hoodie. Um, if you know me, you know I love Batman. I'm obsessed with Batman. Batman is just the best superhero in the world. So got that and it just looks awesome. So I think this would be nice with maybe some, some high-waisted jeans, I think. So I'm excited to wear that. Thank you very much, Diane. What is happening to me today? Okay. And uh, <coughs> this is karma for talking bad about people bumping up the prices. Um, okay, so next thing I got was this. It is the Festive Fragrance Collection. And I believe my mum's... Yeah, it's from Next. Um, in case you feel that you want to get it. Um, and it's diffusers. So it's the things where you... The, you've seen the bottle here. Uh, so it's the bottle and you have the wooden sticks and... It, smells out your house and there's a um, gingerbread mulled wine prosecco and gin fizz so i think these i've not had a chance to properly smell them yet i did try to smell them yesterday when i opened them but the problem is is you've got to pierce the film on the bottle and i, I didn't want to do that because i didn't want it to go everywhere until i had set them out in my house so got these and I'm so excited to smell them. I'm not going to smell them on camera for you uh, just because this video is dragging. So got that and I'm very excited about that. Thank you, mum. 
Okay, and I believe this also, this came from my Auntie Catherine, and it's Palmer's Co... If you know me, you know that I will only apply Palmer's to my body. I love, except my face, I will only apply Palmer's because I love Palmer's, but usually I get the cocoa butter, uh, the one that kind of smells like chocolate. Uh, this one is the coconut oil formula, and it smells so good. It's so coconutty. So I'm excited to smell like something different for a change. So I'm very excited about that. Cannot go wrong with Palmer's. Can't beat it. I'm sorry, there is nothing better in the world than some Palmer's. I am not sponsored by Palmer's, but if they want to. So yep, yeah, I'm so excited about that. Thank you very much. Okay, and this one here, it's from one of those, um, you know, like in your shopping centres, you see, um, it's like just all the fancy bath products and all that. So my mum got this from our local bath product place and it's Wash Posh. I don't know if any of, if there's any other stalls near where you live. And it has unfortunately been bashed around a wee bit, but it still smells incredible. And I'm excited to use it. It smells like um, blue raspberry. Oh, it's so nice. I always hate using these because like they're so, because they just look so pretty. I mean, look at that, it's like a wee blue cupcake. However, like I said, it's been bashed about a wee bit, so I don't feel so guilty about using it now. Oh, so nice. So it's a bath bomb, so I will run myself a wee bath later and this will be getting dropped in. And oh, this video, man. How are you? Are you enjoying my ranty video? That I say as I'm putting this away. Okay, and we're nearly there, I promise. I promise we're nearly there, stick with me. Uh, next thing I got was this, and it's the uh, Himalayan Salt Cleansing. And uh, most people have probably used this at some point. I absolutely love this. Uh, you basically dump it in your bag, and it's good for obviously detoxing all your skin and your body. But do people swear by it for weight loss? I can't say that I've ever noticed a difference um, when I'm trying to lose weight. Uh, when I put these in my bath, but nevertheless, some people swear by it. However, uh, I just love how it smells and I love how it makes my skin feel. So I'm very excited to have that. Thank you very much. Okay, now this, I'll show you these actually first. More socks. Uh, okay, so these ones are cozy socks. So um, not too different from the cuddle socks. The cuddle socks are more kind of bobbly. Whereas these are just that really soft kind of thing you just want to sit and rub on your face all day. So got these and it's two pairs in each packet and these ones are like a kind of glittery, I want to say grey but some people probably, glittery socks, very very nice pretty glittery socks also from Primark um, in case you want to get a pair and they're just oh so nice. And these ones are just grey, there's no glitteriness in them. Oh. <laughs> Rub them in my face all day, so good. Anyway, the next, the next two presents are a wee bit. You probably find them weird, but do you know what? I love them, and I wanted them, and I'm so so happy that I got them. Uh, so this one is a bamboo serving tray with folding legs. I wanted this, and I tell you, I have wanted one of these forever, but I couldn't find them anywhere. I even went on Amazon, and I couldn't find it. And yet the second I hinted to my mum, she's on Amazon and there's thousands of them. Who knew? Like, not me, because I tried Amazon. So I'm so excited to have this uh, because I don't, I live in like the smallest flat in the world. There is no room for me to have a table, even a folding table. There's no room. I live in a box. So I'm just, I thought, I thought I really wanted this so that I can just like put it over my knee when I'm on the couch and just eat my dinner so I'm happy to have that thank you so much mum okay and the next thing I got was this and it's this isn't the other weird you'll know the other weird one when you see it uh, this is a pair of tights nice super cozy tights and they've got that kind of um, cable knit cable, cable knit effect on them so I got these thank you mum 
and yeah this is the other weird one I get a really sweaty head at night that's what I get right I'm a very hot sleeper I got a very very hot head and I, I can't stand it uh, so I very very heavily hinted that I wanted one of these and it's a chill max pillow it's basically a gel insert that you put on top of your pillow like underneath your pillow so in between your pillowcase and your pillow and it keeps your head cool throughout the night because I'm one of those people that I'll wake up in the middle of the night and I'll turn my pillow over to the cold side so hopefully with this I won't need to so I'm so excited about this I will let you know how I got on with this I'm so I'm rabbit and this video is 25 minutes so got this I'm excited thank you mother Okay, and this here, it's, this is the, the best, the best balsamic vinegar that has ever been made. I'm sorry, right, I don't know what you use, but you need to start using this. It's Little Dune, and it's sweet balsamic dressing, and this is the chilli one, but they do all sorts. They obviously have an original, and they have a garlic one, and uh, they have all sorts of different ones. They're quite difficult to come by. A lot of local farmers markets sell them. And a couple of like wee quirky shops will stock them. So please, you can order it. Please, please, please try them. Because I promise balsamic vinegar will never be the same for you. It's so nice. And I love the kind of vintage looking label that you get as well. So I've got, she got me one of these because she knows. She knows me. This is my favourite. So thank you so much, mum. I'm starting to get a sore back sitting here. We're nearly done. We're powering on. Let's do this. This here is uh, it's from Primark. I know that. Um, there's a bit of a story behind it, but because this video is so long, I will spare you it. Basically, I bought this for my mum, and then I tried to trade her for my perfume because I like this one better. That didn't happen. She got me my own. Thank you, mum. Uh, so got this. It's really, really nice. It's like a kind of woody, spicy smell. It is just, if you are in Primark, try it. And while you're there, also try the uh, pomegranate and black tea. It smells exactly like Jo Malone. It is such a good knockoff. So these, if you're ever in Primark, please try them. They are so good. Thank you, ma'am. I feel like I'm doing a haul. Like, I'm just going into like too much detail. Okay, and oh, of course, a throwback to my childhood here, Lip Smackers, and this is Starburst Flavours, uh, so yeah, I'm so excited, these taste and smell so good, and they keep your lips nice and, nice and nourished, so thank you for that, and got, every year you've got to get a calendar, this year I've got Channing Tatum, such a I mean, look how handsome he is. So good looking. So got that. This is the longest video in the world. I'm so sorry, but that's it. Okay. And I also got these. These are big, fuzzy, cozy, wozy jammies. And they are Harry Potter. And it says Hogwarts alumni. And it's got Harry Potter's glasses. Also came with striped bottoms. And oh... Love me some cozy jammies. These are getting worn tonight, just as soon as I've stopped filming this video. So got these, thank you. Uh, also got a nice fuzzy new dressing gown. And it's in this, it's a kind of, it's a sort of nudie colour, like that. And it's so, so soft. It's like, oh, I love it so much. It is a size too small. Um, it's in a six to eight. My mum said when she got it, she just saw the sign that said small. She didn't think to read the size. But it actually fits me. Um, the sleeves are a wee bit short. But I tend to roll my sleeves anyway. So that makes no difference to me whatsoever. Uh, so I'm very excited to have a new dressing gown. Oh, love a new dressing gown. Love new dressing gowns. Thank you, mum. Okay, uh, three more. Three more. We're nearly done. Uh, next thing I got, apparently I hinted for this. I don't remember hinting for this. However, I'm excited for it. Um, it's a foot warmer and massager. <laughs> I'm so excited for this. I'm basically, once I'm finished filming, I'm getting into my new jammies, putting on my new dressing gown and putting my feet into this. I'm so, 
I'm so excited. It says comfort for feet at home or the office. Who's putting their feet in this in the office? I don't know. I probably would if I worked in an office. But yeah, so I'm so excited to use this. Thank you so, so much. Okay, and this one. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. It's not broken, we're fine. This here, um, this came from Diane. Uh, this also has a story behind it. Uh, basically, she bought it for herself a week, like quite a while ago. Uh, but never actually used it and at the time that she bought it I really really wanted it and I tried to buy one um, but they were, all, they were all sold out and she had never actually used this see you can see the tags are still on it and everything so she thought I'll just give that to Morgan for her Christmas and thank you I'm glad you did I know where this is going and now I'll never lose my keys again the amount of times I have been late for work or wherever I'm going because I've lost my keys I am the master of losing my keys. I locked myself in the house on Saturday. In the house. I came home for lunch, locked the door for whatever reason, had my lunch and couldn't find the keys. Never again. Thank you, Diane. All right, and last thing. Yes, I asked for this. I don't care that I'm 27 and still technically young. I asked for this. It's a food processor. I don't, I don't, I'm, I'm so happy with this. Thank you so much, mum. Um, I don't really know what else to say. It's, it's a food processor. We all know what a food processor is. And this one is by Kenwood. And I happen to know that she got this in B&M, um, in case you are interested, but I'm sure you can get it from kind of most places. So it has all these different, fun I'm so excited. There was a time in my life that was random. Uh, yeah, I remember even as little as like three, four years ago, I would have wanted clothes and shoes. And then before that, I would have wanted like toys and games. Now I'm all about the kitchen appliances. That is a sign that I'm getting old. Anyway, um, that is everything. I am so, so sorry for the, the length of this video and the ranting in this video and the fact that I look like death. But that's just it. That's just me, um, and I am so happy and so, so grateful for everything that I got this year. Um, you have just, everyone has gone above and beyond this year, and I am so happy and I'm so grateful for everything that I got. And um, I had such a special day yesterday. It was a particularly special Christmas for us this year. So, um, and I hope that everyone there, uh, everyone watching, I hope, that everyone watching this video um, also had a really, really lovely Christmas. I hope you spent it with all your loved ones and made some really special memories. And like I said, I will make a Boxing Day video, a Boxing Day sales video for you tomorrow and upload it tomorrow. Um, so you'll have that to look forward to and hopefully I'll rant a wee bit less than that one. But uh, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow then. Bye bye.